You've seen the time lapse in the previous episode. No way I'm doing this again. Welcome back in the second very important episode working from home. Previous week we did a conditioning or I did conditioning and I hope you did as well. I just actually warmed up with it. The plan for today is to work on, in my opinion, crucial essentials uh, for capoeira movements. There are four things which I consider as must know, must master actually. Kataji hints, hat stand, headstand and bridges. Then you can combine those and create movements. All capoeira floreros, in my opinion, are or at least 99% of them are based on those four movements. Um, so I'm just gonna work on them today. Um, and that's it, let's move on. Let's start with the hardest one, which is handstand, at least in my opinion. Let's break some actual handstand. So, second hardest in my opinion, it's Kataji Hins. Let's do this. Okay, now I'm gonna rest my wrist a little bit and let's do the third one which is headstand. Okay, last one guys, bridges.
here is where the fun starts we're gonna combine movements so first combination is do bridge and kadaji hinsi and let's see what happens i'm pretty sure you already know what's gonna happen by bridge kadaji hins and headstand handstand kadaji hins it's really cool but i'm not sure if i can actually do this I'm not sure if I can have enough space to do this, but I'll try anyway. As I said before, that was not a tutorial, nothing like this, just training for myself. If you're interested in watching and getting more ideas for those four movements, uh, I've actually recorded episodes, but I'm sure you, you saw the, the, the numbers I, I put there next to the uh, names of the movements. I'm gonna try to combine everything now and let's see what happens. Apart from that, guys, thanks very much for watching and well, I'll see you next week, I guess. I hope. We'll see. Take care.